Hey everybody, uh, I just wanted to do a real quick uh, myth video. Right now we have, there's a myth going out there I hear everyone say, one of the great things about aquaponics is no weeding. Well I tell you that is a myth and let me prove it to you. See this? There. Where is it? There it is. I just had to pull that weed. I'll tell you, it's back breaking. Alright, one other thing I wanted to go over. Um, as much as we all want to survive strictly on what the fish produce, the reality is they just don't produce everything we need. So, we have to add, every so often we have to add a few things. When I first started cycling this system, I, uh, well, I did everything wrong. I cycled with fish, and I put a bunch of plants in. I'm trying to grow plants. I got fish. I got no bacterial colony started. I just kind of put it together. And But one of the things I was able to do is I found this stuff. This is a seaweed extract. And it's it's fantastic, all right? It's a 20-20-20 plus five percent fertilizer. It's got uh, yeah, it's got everything you need, but it also has in it. You can take a look. It's got everything: potassium, phosphorus, nitrite, nitrate, iron, zinc, copper, manganese, boron, cobalt. It's it's a perfect all-around additive to the system. It's completely water soluble, and uh, I'm about to add just a little bit. Even though the system looks beautiful, uh, I've been seeing a few things that are a little yellow. So rather than take a chance, I'm just going to add a little bit. I'll just show you what it looks like. I shake it up. And then, oh, this is not the best. I mean, uh, all right, I'm back. All we do is I shake this stuff up, pour some of it into this cup, and all this is this is just one of those laundry dispenser cups. You know, you buy some Tide or whatever laundry soap, and you get these little things. I just put a little bit in this. If you look, it's a green, thick. In fact, it kind of reminds me of the texture of laundry soap. And I just add this to the system. I put it right into, uh, I put it right in where the grow beds, are. in fact, let me show you. Okay, right here is where the water comes in. I have a little pipe that goes right to the bottom. I just put it in here. That's it. Now, that gives me a good, quick Natural fertilizer does not hurt the fish. Plants grow better with it. And it really makes my system work better. Uh, I decided to do this real quick because I was talking with uh, somebody else who, was, who had some plants that looked rough. And I asked if he put any uh, seaweed extract in his system. And he said the only thing he put in was iron. Now I've got this chelated iron. Now all of us know the one thing that the system that we have to supplement. There's no way around it is iron. And uh, I get this stuff. And whenever you put this in the system, the water becomes tea-like color. And... Uh, it takes a few days to be able to see the bottom of the fish tank again, but all my plants are doing wonderfully. 
everything, I mean, not, I can't say all, most of my plants are doing wonderfully. So, it's, uh, it, it's a necessary thing we have to do sometimes. But, I don't know if you guys will ever be able to find this exact stuff. Alright. Now, this stuff was probably pretty expensive comparatively. This was about 2,000 Jamaican dollars, which is about 18, 17, 18 U.S. dollars. Um, so, I'm sure you could find something cheaper and uh, that would work where you are. But, I tell you, the seaweed extract, is a, it, it has made a significant difference. Uh-oh. I have to go to back-breaking work. I found a weed. Ready? Oh, I don't know how I can handle this brutal backbreaking work here. All right, everybody. Hope it helps. God bless. Be safe.